Hello guys, today I would like to talk with you about an issue I have with the Path of Exile engine, which I assume comes from the fact that it was programmed firstly for single cores and got torched multi-core capabilities later on, and I can reproduce this issue every time. I use Amazon Afterburn to show you my uh, stats right here on the left side. I'm running a GTX 1070 which is right now at 80% to 80% usage. And I'm running um, Ryzen 7 1700 at 3.6 GHz, like you can see here. And the real problem is that one CPU core always tends to stick around 70 to 80% in idling, idle mode. I can even re uh, remove my MTX for me. So, no MTX now. So it's just the, the raw engine kind of. And I'm using a Scorching Ray combined with Whispering Ice. So while I channel Scorching Ray, it will trigger the Ice Storm of Whispering Ice. You can see right in the top left corner, my GPU is right now at around 70 to maybe 60 to 80, roughly. And my CPU overall is around 30% usage, and let's channel! So you can watch my overall CPU usage goes up to above 40, nearly 50%. And my GPU usage actually drops, like the frame drop. It drops from 80% to uh, around 50%. And I can only assume that this is because this effect is kind of badly implemented in the engine. Either Scorching Ray or Ice Storm seems to be implemented on a CPU usage level, not a GPU usage level. And I'm not actually don't actually know what is limiting the FPS here. That they dropped to around under 50 from over 200, which is pretty annoying. I'm running a 144 Hz monitor. And so my, I kind of infused to high frame rates, and this is not smooth gameplay anymore for me. And that's actually why I stopped playing this build. So if I stop here, my GPU usage goes up again, my CPU usage goes down again, and my FPS goes up to, are going up to 200 again. Yeah, I, I know that uh, particle effects can cause games to run slower, but at like one third of the speed one third of the frame rate is pretty awful for any engine so maybe gg you can do something about it maybe you can't i just wanted to let you know thanks guys for watching and have a great day